I'm going to show you a simple technique to color in wood floors and to add some depth to the texture of the planks. For this technique to work well, you want to make sure you have your drawing assist feature turned on. So when you make these horizontal strokes across the floor, the drawing assist is going to help you keep your line straight. And you can see that I have my brush opacity turned down to about 60 to 70% so that this will give me some room to overlay colors on top. The first step is very simple. It's just to go over every plank to adding a base hue. And the next step is to add some additional color on every other plank without changing the swatch. Next, what I like to do is to select a slightly different shade of brown to add some new hue to the planks. And you can do this a couple of times. And you can tell when I do this, I'm not often coloring the entire plank of wood from start to finish. Oftentimes it's just the head or the tail and I'll use a new color to introduce a variation. When you're happy with the result, you can start to erase color that are outside of the boundaries like on the couch, the rug, the table that are contaminated with the wood floor. And a small tip, you can erase with the same Copic marker brush so the edges are naturally blended in. Last part of this exercise is to adjust for hue and saturation. And you can see in my finished example, the color of the wood was lighter and more desaturated. And you can do this simply by desaturating and increasing the brightness using the hue saturation slider. 